hello viewers welcome back to my youtube channel hopefully you all will be fine like before again i bring the some excited news of the iraqi dinar so guys today we will discuss about the latest exchange rate of the iraqi dinar iraqi dinar revaluation and the development in iraq for revaluation of currency so guys without wasting time we start the video if my video is helpful for you please like and subscribe my channel i pray for you all god give you long life good health and wealth and the best of luck hey guys welcome back to iraqi dinar today if you haven't already make sure to subscribe for more of the latest updates and insights on the iraqi dinar today We've got some exciting news to dive into, including updates from Guru Militiaman and other key intel groups. Let's get started. Iraq is pushing forward with the development road project, and whether you like it or not, they're moving toward going international. Although Iraq isn't on Forex yet, there's plenty of buzz suggesting that it's only a matter of time before they get there. The momentum is building, and soon, we could see the dinar moving to the forex market. How exciting is that? A recent article from a government advisor is making waves, explaining the potential for Iraq to use the dinar instead of the dollar for all sales. The article discusses the risks of pegging the dinar to oil prices and the plan to re-peg the dinar to a basket of international currencies from top developed nations. This is much more stable and aligns with Dr. Shabibi and the IMF's long-term plans for Iraq. It seems like Iraq is aiming for a more secure and flexible currency system, not dependent on the fluctuating price of oil. Big things are on the horizon for the dinar. Prime Minister al-Sudani recently chaired a meeting on tax reform, and the results are looking promising. Iraq saw 22% growth in tax revenues, which is a clear indication that the economic reforms are starting to take effect. This is huge news, as it shows that Iraq's economic strategies are working, and they're one step closer to their goal of long-term stability and growth. In other news, Al-Masharani has secured the majority of deputy approvals for his nomination as Speaker of Parliament. Now, we're just waiting for the vote. Once Iraq has all three presidents in place, the optics of opening the country to the world with their real effective exchange rate will likely boost global investor confidence. This could be the security and stability investors have been waiting for. On the ground, a bank friend shared an interesting perspective, printing new currency could raise inflation but Iraq currently enjoys low inflation. So, they don't see a need for new zero notes. However, the lower denomination notes are reportedly close to being released to the citizens of Iraq, which is a major step in their economic reform. Meanwhile, Iraq's Ministry of Oil announced some impressive export figures for Julie over 108 million barrels of crude oil were exported. This is another strong indicator of Iraq's economic health, and oil revenues will undoubtedly play a key role in supporting the value of the dinar as reforms take hold. That's all for today's update, folks. There's a lot to be optimistic about as Iraq continues to push forward with its economic and monetary reforms. Remember to subscribe, hit the notification bell and share this video with anyone interested in the latest Iraqi dinar news. What do you think about these updates? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll catch you in the next video.